Hi guys, welcome to my videos. So guys, today in this video, I'm going to show you how to apply special permission in India uh, as an OCI. Before I proceed further, if you have not already subscribed to my channel, please don't subscribe right now. And also, I would like to clarify, neither I'm an immigration consultant nor I'm a government body. So in case you take anything out of this, you do it at your own risk. All right, guys, so let's proceed. So guys, in front of you, I've opened online OCI services site. Here you have an option, apply for special permission only for existing OCI card holder. Now, with the very first question arrives, OCI is like many per se, it's like almost second series, like virtual citizen, which is true in many aspects. You get most of the rights, but there are certain rights you don't have. For example, if you want to take research, if you want to participate in any missionary or tablik or mountaineering or journalistic activities, if you want to take any internship in a foreign diplomatic mission of foreign government or nation and similar employment, okay? To visit any places that fall within the protected and restricted or prohibited areas. Okay. So this. So we are going to walk through this, how you can do. So let's click on proceed. Terms condition. We have been like you need to type in block letters. And this can be done only by an existing OCI card holder. For foreign nationals who are not an OCI card holder, there is a separate process. Okay. You can do uh, like if granted these activities, whichever is granted. You have to put photograph, signature, okay? And what are the documents you need for research activities? These are the documents for mountaineering, for missionary, for internship, employment, for the bleak, for general activity, okay? All right. So these things you need, okay? All right, so you need you can uh, we go through it, accept the condition, click on proceed. Now, first you need to clear the capture. I'm gonna do that. So you can fill a new permission application or partial fill a new application. Just example. Of course, I will not be doing it so in certain sections i have removed for, for privacy reasons okay so on top of this your details are displayed your application uh, your applicant name passport number oci number gender and nationality okay now why you need to do uh, special permission so let's say i'm going there for doing mountaineering so i select this are you currently residing in india i select no current country where you are residing. So you have to uh, do this very carefully as per your case. So you need to select the mission, like uh, based on the country, where you are going to do mountaineering activity. Like this, these questions are going to vary. Okay. Present residential address in uh, India abroad, individual group that you need to select, name of organizer, value, current nationality, the whole dual national email ID of foreigners, so like basic details they have asked. Okay. And then at the end, you have submit. Okay. Certain areas I have uh, removed, okay? And with this, like it's gonna be submitted to the consulate and it will give you further instructions how to follow. Again, the uh, further instructions about how to follow and, or, and to submit additional documents, they can vary based on the mission. So this is how it, uh, it works, guys. Let me know what you feel about it. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to the channel. Thank you.